New tonight 11, the coronavirus has claimed another victim, but this time it's a vocational school. And KZI 9 News reporter Con McCarthy is live outside of Pioneer Pacific College in Springfield, where school officials announced today their doors will not be reopening after the pandemic is over. Connor. That's right, China. It's dark here at Pioneer Pacific College, and it will remain dark indefinitely. Now, students come to this vocational school to get training in the medical field, but students today received an email from school officials saying that their doors won't open again. I talked to one student this evening who says she is one internship away from completing her program, but she fears that she will have to start all over. Now, students received this email around 3 p.m. School officials blame the pandemic for the closure because according to them, a vocational school requires many in-person, hands-on classes, something they say is nearly impossible to do to, under the governor's current COVID-19 regulations. Kaylee Gribling, a now former student, says when she enrolled in the school, they told her many credits might not be transferable. So with today's announcement, she says she feels like the school abandoned her. I feel like they don't care. Like, they just said, okay, we're done, bye, good luck, and that was it, and it just feels really awful. Gribbling says throughout the pandemic, she feels like the school has not communicated with her and other students about the future of classes. She also says she hopes a lot of her student loans can be waived because of the school's closures. Now, there are two other camp campuses in Oregon. There's one in Beaverton and Portland, and it's unclear at this time whether those campuses will remain open. And KEZI did reach out to Pioneer Pacific College for comment, but we have not heard back at this time. Live in Springfield, Connor McCarthy, KEZI 9 News.